Hi everyone, I am back with a super fun Christmas in July project for you. These adorable little Christmas tree ornaments are super easy to make and I made them all with just scrap materials that I had around. So I used some scrap ribbon that I had, some scrap felt, and then these little twigs and wooden stars that I had. And with that, I was able to make five of these adorable little ornaments in about a half hour. So let's go ahead and get started and I'll tell you what supplies you need to make these. The great thing about these little trees is you only need five supplies to get started. So the first thing you're gonna need is a little wooden stick. You can use a popsicle stick. You can use a little twig from the yard. We're also gonna need a little star for the top of the tree, some string just to use for the ornament holder. And then we're gonna need five or six pieces of felt or ribbon that are cut between seven and two inches. So you're going to wanna to start with seven inches, then six inches, then five, then four, then three, then two. And then also some glue to adhere everything together. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm just gonna add some glue right to the center of my strip of felt. And then I'm going to fold in both sides together and make a seam kind of in the middle there. And you just wanna be careful to only add glue to the center there because we want the little ends of the Christmas tree, the sides to flare out a little bit to give the ornament some body and dimension. And this is a great craft to do like with a group, with your grandchildren, if you're a teacher, with your students in class. You don't need to use hot glue for this. You can definitely use Elmer's glue. I'm just using hot glue because it's my favorite glue to work with. Always makes me happy when I get the glue gun out. So that is usually um, what I use. And also I like that it dries super quick. So when you're doing crafts like this, um, I, I really like them to go fast so that I can make a whole bunch of them. So I'm just going to keep going here. Now you may need five or six strips, depending on how big your strip is. Maybe you need seven. Um, I'm going to end up using five here. I cut strips for six, but my little twig was a little bit short. So I ended up using five. I actually think when you are creating the, these, if you can use an uneven number of strips, it will probably make it look better. And then we're just gonna start attaching the little pieces of felt to the tree. And I like to apply them in like a little bit of a wonky fashion. So you don't want them to be super straight across. You don't want them to be perpendicular. You want them to be a little bit off center and you'll stagger it so it goes, one goes one way and then the next one goes the other so that it just gives it that like nice natural little look there. And of course you could have one or two that are straight perpendicular if you like that. But I just think making it like this where it's just a little bit wonky, one, it makes it easier so you're not worried about getting anything straight, but it does also look better design wise. And then we're just gonna add our little wooden star to the top there. I think that one is one inch, but you know, you can use a variety of sizes, it'll be fine. I'm gonna take my little eight inch um, piece of string and I'm just gonna tie a knot at the end and then I'm just gonna cut off the tail there. And then I'm gonna add some more hot glue to the back of the star and just attach the string right there, right at the knot so that it's hidden behind the star. And then I'll add a little bit more hot glue just to make sure that it stays adhered. And there you have it, it is that simple. We have a cute little felt tree ornament. You can also use other materials for this. I'll show you a couple examples in a bit for some ribbon. This one here I made just using all the scraps that I have in my little felt scrap pile. So this is a great like stash buster project to do. And it's also just kind of fun, right, to use um, materials you already have on hand that you thought you were gonna throw out. This tree is a little bit fancier. I added a resin star as well to the top there and I layered some of the wooden stars just to give it a little bit more interest. And then here's a version with ribbon. This is a quarter of an inch or no, maybe half of an inch thick ribbon. And I just had some of that on hand, some scrap ribbon, and they also make great little trees. 
And there you have it. So here are our little DIY Christmas trees. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I really hope that you try to make some yourself. Have a great day, everyone. And I will see you again soon in the next video.